passing through the dark, deep recesses of space with no direction at all are rogue planets, which kind of sounds like the perfect hideout for the new Star Wars films. But rogue planets, or interstellar planets, or orphan planets as they're also called, are planetary mass objects that orbit the galaxy directly. This means they have either been ejected from the planetary system in which they were formed, or have never been gravitationally bound to any star. What I'm getting at is that these are homeless worlds, planets that have neither sunrises nor sunsets set adrift in the galaxy's perpetual night. Wait, how do we even find a planet without a star? For now, the best way to find these lonely planets is with infrared telescopes looking for a rogue planet's heat signature, or use a technique called gravitational microlensing that will help you find the cooler planets. Microlensing uses gravity's ability to bend and alter light. If a massive object, say a rogue planet, passes between a star and Earth, the planet can act as a lens, curving and tweaking the star's light as seen from Earth. In general, the more massive the planet, the more affected the light. Sort of like when a plane passes overhead and you just barely notice the shadow bend over you. Well, there you have it. Did you find that interesting? Because if you did, you should check out this episode where we do our best to explain black holes. A black hole is what you get when a very large star implodes from the pull of its own gravity. The pull is so intense that all the mass of the star crushes down to a single point. Thanks for watching, guys. Please subscribe.